I'm Adam Fennig with Fennig Equipment, and you're tuned into the Talking Shed. Uh, today it's October uh, 27th, I believe, and we're out here shelling corn. Uh, we've got three rows of the Yield Savers on the left side of our head. It's a, a John Deere 643 head, and uh, on the right side we don't have any of the Yield Savers, just standard chains. And uh, so we pulled the combine in here, stopped, and backed out. That's a way to find true header loss versus what you're spitting out of the back of the machine. So what we found here in a five foot section, uh, we found seven kernels here on this side. Um, that would be, you know, this is about 12 square foot. So, uh, you know, that would be less than a, less than a bushel um, that we're losing here on this, on the yield saver side. And you'll see here in a minute, a big difference of, of what we're seeing between the two is the small ears that are making it through the cracks. For example, over here, not only did we find almost three times more kernels, we have 19 kernels here that we found without the yield savers in this same five foot section. But the deal breaker is kernels or ears like this. Smaller ears that uh, they make it to the head, but they either bounce off or they get flipped up and uh, don't quite make it into the machine. So you take the 19 plus some of these smaller ears and it really adds up. Um, this stuff's uh, running I'd say probably around 15 average. Uh, it's fairly dry stuff so it's pretty fragile and it shatters pretty quick. So that's what we're seeing here. We're seeing a lot of differences and uh, we'll probably get the, the rest of the three put on here yet tonight. So thanks for tuning in.